Alright guys, hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to continue the US States Tournament. Now, I've since I've decided to make a special map. Special for the states that lost. And that'll be a second chance. I'm gonna go to one thousand and then the top three states will get to move on. Because it has a change up. After that, because all the other states, the states that won, all get to continue. Only three states of this side get to continue. And the top eight will move on. I mean, as soon as like three of them, and the rest, all these fight off on them. Yeah, you know, it'll be. You know, it's gonna be. It's gonna be 1v1. And there's gonna be. Like, it's gonna be like a little tournament bracket. 1v1. And there's gonna be another 1v1. 2v1. And then yeah, like, four 1v1s, and they'll move on to make two other matches, which the winners of those will go into the final match. And then we'll decide who's the true one. And since, you know, if I just let this not be, as it is, California would be Leakman, so I tried to weaken a bit. But without further ado, let's get in the video. Also, I've figured out in this future this entire time. I can just hit this button. Louisiana beat Texas. I'm safe to say that Texas. Okay, let's pause it for a second. So it looks like it's the crazy. Or also not as Oklahoma, just sometimes like that. Mm. It looks like Illinois has beat Missouri. It looks like Nebraska was beat by South Dakota. South one is currently at war with Arizona. I don't know how that's gonna go. Probably in the side of California. California is going to win on today. And also, surprisingly, Louisiana beat Texas. I mean, I know I gave him this advantage. I didn't know I gave him that bad of a disadvantage. Oh, I'm too late now. And everyone else is so much more active. There's no point in on top. Or he knows who's on top. My home state's going to take it over. Alrighty, yay. Oregon will 
Louisiana, New Mexico, California. Let's play who's not gonna win. Yep, my home state's not winning. It's obviously a battle. I'm really rooting for Kentucky, but I know they're not going. You can pretty much tell by the top. Like, if you're not in the top, I'd say California is the last one that actually has a chance.
Yeah, it looks like Oregon is going to win. If Louisiana wants to win, they better start attacking people. Watch all this doom because you're not gonna win. Louisiana's not gonna win from just doing nothing. Soon next. Oh, I never paused the game. Wyoming and actually probably Louisiana and Oregon. Just playing because you know there's not enough states that are bigger than Minnesota has a chance. And Kentucky do. I, I'd say. It's, and I guess maybe Idaho. I'd say Idaho, Minnesota, and Kentucky have a chance. Minnesota and take all their land. Which has nine problems to their six. And fifteen provinces. Yeah, and that's barely gonna be enough to beat Louisiana. But they might be able to win with Washington, whoever that is, not your dog. And that's really what people have a chance. Minnesota, maybe. They don't have any troops. You can count vassals as still a state. I don't know. I think I don't think we should consider that. I think Wyoming might lose. So I don't think I can count uh, a vassal as an actual state. Even though it's technically really big. 
is involved New Mexico's gonna win. If Kentucky doesn't get involved then Minnesota and they've already won. Louisiana's moving on. Oh, this turns a bit, please turn a bit. Oh yeah, I forgot, we have to turn 1,000, we gotta speed this up a bit. Speed up the process. What's gonna happen in Oregon, Wyoming? And they walk in Wyoming battle. Because Wyoming can weaken them enough, then Minnesota will move on. Because, you know, they'll have less provinces than Minnesota. It's not very fair battle, I don't think. Or Oregon be Wyoming, I don't care. Thank you. Open the rebels are gonna strip Wyoming and they're gonna advance back to New Mexico. I actually think they might win because, you know, they plan out more troops. And every time they yeah, always plus their army up as, up as much as they can, they try and claim as many provinces as possible with their army. I 
don't think this war will ever end. Because can keep going back and forth. As long as Wyoming keeps getting all of his freaking rebels. They'll just be able to push back in New Mexico and take New Mexico. And then a little bit up. And then Wyoming's troops manage to come down and then attack them, bring them back to Arizona. And then eventually they'll push back up. Big push. Farthest they've made so far. The question is, how long will it actually last? Yup, as soon as they get that one province, they have lost all that land. It's all gonna go back down. No, with all these rebels. And it's gone all the way back down here. See, it's already turned 580. It's like it been waging on for like years. This is a new 100 years of war instead of, but instead of being Britain and France, it's Wyoming and Oregon. Because they're so equally matched, none of them, go, neither of them win. Turn, turn 620. April 10th, It's looking like Oregon is ever so slightly stronger. Just a little though. Not by much. They're a bit stronger. Okay. It looks like nothing's happening. Right now. It looks like it's just been the same thing again and again and again. Sometimes you see a big push by Oregon, but then they eventually get pushed back by Wyoming. And it never ends. I'll be turn 700. Say peace out. Huh? 
I'm guessing they did. Turns to go. Hmm. Before the results would be calculated. Nothing's really happening. There's not much to talk about, I guess. I just haven't seen any advancements. Okay, right now I'm just thinking about like, a thumbnail because nothing's happening. I'm kidding. No one's at work. There's some people pretty close to it. It's like about to 900, and the only way another person can win is like if Minnesota declared war on Kentucky and they won, or Kentucky declared war on Minnesota and they won. If Minnesota declared war on Kentucky and Kentucky won, as long as, like, I'd be Idaho winning. Idaho fans, fans from Idaho. I don't think they're gonna win. Even though I checked my stats and the people who have gone public are from Oklahoma and Texas. So yeah, Texas didn't exactly win. Got beat by Louisiana. Turn line 13. Game will almost be over soon. Wait, who's attacking who? Oh, this isn't good.
This isn't looking good for Wyoming. I'm just gonna lose, aren't they? And it's hard enough for them to defend off Oregon, but with Louisiana fighting as well. Wyoming's gonna lose. Let's pause it right here. 968, uh. But still, easily, Wyoming is still power. Uh, Wyoming's still moving on. You know what? Just because I feel like it, I feel like a lot of other people are going to win. I want to see him continue a little past 1,000. Not too much longer. But... If Kentucky declares a war on, like, Minnesota, there's actually a chance that they could win. I mean, Minnesota could win. <laughs> Look at that soldier count. I mean, unless Kentucky can recruit more soldiers, then that'd be good. Wyoming's gonna get crushed. How is he still at equal power? I mean, not really. The only reason I'm really continuing this is because there's actually a chance. someone else could win. Like, if Oregon destroys Louisiana, or the other way around, Yep, Louisiana's gonna win. And that means Kentucky has no chance. I mean, unless Kentucky attacked them, like, right now. Oh, they're distracted. Uh, Kentucky and Hawaii are the same team. Looks like Idaho. Jeez, if Idaho is destroyed, then that means Kentucky will move on.
I guess then Oregon's chances and Idaho's chances will be ruined. Okay, it looks like, like this. Kentucky is actually gonna move on. Well, I mean, that's far enough, right? So, I guess that means Kentucky, Minnesota, and Louisiana will be moving on to the next round. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.